We're going to do a video on NIO, NIO stock, NIO stock analysis. We've got a daily chart of NIO here. We're going to do some technical analysis on it. Take a look at this. We've got a blue 200 day moving average, and you can see this chart's been in the bear market since about, the stock's been in the bear market since about November 21, and came up here and bounced on the 200 day moving average or underneath it about September 15th and put in new lows down here right around October 24th. Now, the stock had been. It's trying to put in a bottom and it didn't do a very good job of it. You can see it kind of went sideways for a while and that's not the, what, what you want to see. You want to see more of a rally similar to this, not exactly like that, but similar to that. And you just didn't get it. The, the, the five day stayed not flat, but almost flat and then put a little V. That's not the way you rally out of something. So the end of the day, we closed above the uh, 20 day moving average right here November 4th, but then turned right back around the next day, which was not a good sign. Today we're selling off down 6%. It's $10.30 on about 16 million shares. Average daily volume is 52 million shares. So it's not a huge amount of money because this is a low price stock, but it is down almost 6%. And if we take a look at this, we'll look at an hourly chart here real quick. We can see that what, what you're seeing here is this is a, a 200 hour moving average. And you can see that it's been below that 200 hour moving average all the way back since September 21st of 2022. So the reality of it is the second this stock approached something that that uh, you know, sophisticated people can look at and say, hey, that's a selling point. They sold the heck out of it. So they were waiting for some reason to dump the stock. You can see somebody pushed it up. And when they pushed it up, they sold the heck out of it. So this is a very, from a technical perspective, this is a very weak stock. This, of course, is an intraday chart. Each bar represents an hour. This is a very weak situation for this stock to be in. Um, there's, it was overbought. Now it looks to me like it's getting oversold. Uh, today is the 8th. It's about 9, almost 10 o'clock. And it, on this hourly chart, it looks like it's a little oversold. So there's several things going on here. If you look at this bottom right here of $9.04, that's basically support for this stock right this second. That's a new point that they've established support for. And this would be your new point for resistance right here. This point at, uh, if I can get it on there, uh, $12.37. So this this price is probably going to come down here to the $9.45 range, something like that. Today's range low is uh, $10.08. It's probably going to come down to the $9.45-ish, maybe today, maybe tomorrow, um, and then rally up a little bit. I don't see a huge amount of issues with this stock other than the, right the second other than the fact that it's probably going to trade in its trading range. And again, the upper limit, this 12 and the lower limit, this uh nine dollars it looks like nine dollars and four cents so that's where we are today on nio let's go down and take a look and see what rbm research says about it we cover uh, nio it's right here and it's got buys on it at nine dollars and 93 cents so that, that hasn't been hit 1035 has been hit and 1077 has not been hit so the five day is a live price this 1035 has been hit and we'd have to look at it really closely to see but it looks like it's probably underwater right this second uh, looks like it's around ten dollars and twenty cents right this second, so slightly underwater. So, uh, but that's a five-day hold. So keep in mind, everything's for entertainment purposes only, all hypothetical, and you have to trade at your own risk. But um, that's what we've got for you with NIO for non-trend following. Let's look at trend following real quick and see if that gives us any kind of indication of what's going on. If we can find them here, we've got thirty-day trend following system here somewhere right here so let's take nio is around here somewhere right here it says flat for today which is really interesting so this this system is a 30-day hold get in today assuming your own judgment says it's a good idea and get out at the end of 30 trading days at a loss or take your profits as soon as you can get them this is for the 8th today of november and it'll come out by flats and shorts today it's showing a flat on nio which is consistent with my analysis so those are your two entry systems for today the non-trend non following that I showed you above, and these are the trend following systems, all algorithmically generated. You can get access to all these every morning before 7 a.m. at rbmresearch.com. Link in the description below. Just follow it over there. Put in your credit card. Uh, excuse me. Put in your email address. No credit card required. Access is free. And get access to 190 stocks, the major forex pairs, BTC, crypto, and the most liquid futures contracts, all updated by 7 a.m. If you have a ticker symbol you want us to do a... Uh, an analysis on please leave it in the comment section below if it's a big one and, and we think a lot of people would like it we'll do it for you please leave a, a good comment and uh, if you like this video please click the like button if you want to subscribe please do that as well